Hey guys, what's up? By Sectatron here from One Hive Gazette, here with the next round of live action. And this is kind of a potluck type war. One Hive split up into uh, two different clans. One of the ones we went to is WMS Warriors. I think it's a leader's old clan. Uh, so we're just hanging out here and we did a search, I think, at a designated time and got matched up with a very good clan here. Uh, looks like they're going to have a great war. We should have a good war as well, so it's going to be close, going to be a lot of fun. I opted out by choice just because I didn't want to have to gem my queen, but um, I'm still going to be hanging out and catching some live action for you guys. Uh, just so you know, I won't be able to catch anything tomorrow as I'll be uh, away from my house the entire day for the most part. But tonight, whatever I can catch, uh, we'll see. So hopefully I'll get a few attacks in the next few hours before I go to bed. Uh, be right back. All right, looks like we have Anthony going in live here. Um, he has a, what is this, a healer, P.E.K.K.A., baby dragon combo cooked up. I guess that's uh, kind of an H, uh, I'm not even going to try with the with the acronym, but um, I'm sure he has bowlers in the CC. Uh, looks like the four air defenses on that base are pretty central, so he's going to go in there, uh, try to get those four air defenses taken out, and then use these baby dragons along the outside of the base. Uh, so there go the bowlers. He has uh, what, a jump, three rages, so uh, should be able to get pretty deep into the base here with, uh, I guess, all his spells are going to be used on that kill squad. So should work out pretty nicely here if everything stays together and the healers can uh, get the splash heal on most of his troops. Out come the CC troops, has the poison for them. Uh, looks like he has a one baby dragon started. Uh, as soon as these air defenses start to go down, he should get those baby dragons down as soon as possible to let them start taking out trash buildings and then move in on the defenses. Um, but has two of the, of the four air defenses down. That's really all he needs because the baby dragons should be enough to clean up the rest of the base as long as the air defenses are down. Um, the queen's working up top. He still has her ability. He needs to use that uh, right there. Uh, three air defenses down. That one bowler uh, looks like it might get up there and get that air defense taken out. Um, no, it looks like it locked onto the king. Uh, but I think that should go down eventually. The baby dragons are swarming this base. Only a few defenses up, uh, even non-air defenses. Um, and that last air defense just went down. So crush this base. Uh, this is going to be a pretty easy three-star, it looks like. Uh, so nice attack to Anthony. Good job recognizing that base and uh, noticing that the air defenses were all central and using the baby dragons around the outside with the uh, P.E.K.K.A.s and the bowlers in the middle. Um, so nice attack there. Uh, anyway, though, uh, we'll go ahead and keep waiting for the next attack. Hopefully, we can get a few more. Uh, we'll give Anthony a woo, looks like. Um, scroll down here, got a few people on, so that's cool. Uh, but anyway, like I said, uh, hopefully, before I go to bed in the next hour or so, we can get a few more attacks, maybe even a Town Hall 10 attack, if we're lucky. Uh, be right back with the next one. Okay, we got 007, uh, the other one, the one that's spelled out. Um, not just the actual numbers themselves, so we have two different 007s, uh, but this one is the other one. He's going in live here, and looks like he has a P.E.K.K.A., another kind of P.E.K.K.A. army with healers. Um, yeah, I guess that's a pretty similar composition, except he has the Lava Hound instead of the uh, Baby Dragons, so he should come in here, try to get a good uh, chunk of the base taken out, then use the uh, Lava Hound and the Balloons for the rest of it. Um, I'm sure he once again has those bowlers in the CC. Seems like pretty much every Town Hall 9 attack he uses them and I think you know some kind of nerf would help out a lot with the balancing on that. But anyway, everything moving in here. Uh, and you notice that one P.E.K.K.A got really low but I think those Rage Tealers will get it back up. So like I said before, that's the benefit of the P.E.K.K.A. Uh, it can get really low but its health will come back up unlike the Giant which will just die. Um, but uh, the queen and quite a few bowlers walked, and that one baby dragon in the CC should be um, a ton of trouble because it lo doesn't look like he has anything inside uh, his kill squad that's inside the base that can target that baby dragon. Uh, yeah, I don't think he does. So uh, things are just going to slowly get withered away by it. Um, he is going pretty strong, though, and a big part of the base is already taken out. Uh, you can see the Tesla farm is popping at, up top there. So he actually got through quite a bit of the base, and right there, the queen locks onto that baby dragon. So that is down. Um, doesn't have a whole lot of troops left, but has the Lava Hound and the balloons uh, left to deploy. So I guess he's just going to get those. Yeah, right there, gets those going. The one thing is that the um, the all air defenses are down, so the Lava Hound isn't tanking as much as it could. 
But right here, it looks like it'll get front and center stage and tank for the Teslas and that Wizard Tower. Um, needs to get these balloons going because time is a little bit low. There go the ones at the bottom, but they're not going to quite make it, it looks like. Um, another two going in. That'll get that Archer Tower taken out. No corner builders huts except for that one on the left there. But it looks like he has a wizard for that. This one will be a three star. Um, a little bit close. I thought time might be an issue, but he's going to have plenty of time, it looks like, to get the job done. Uh, so kind of a, not the cleanest attack, but got the job done. And uh, I think this just goes to show how powerful kind of the uh, the P.E.K.K.A. Bowler Healer combo is. And then you can throw in Baby Dragons or Lava Hound or something like that along with uh, the rest of your troops. And it'll get the three star most of the time, even if you have a few uh, kind of small mistakes in there. So anyway, though, nice attack to double 007. Hopefully I can catch one more attack for you guys. Um, we've had a few Town Hall 9s go in uh, in the last little while. So uh, if I can catch one more, that'd be good. So stay right there and I'll be right back. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to end it right there. I uh, could only catch those two attacks. After those, everyone kind of got shy and no one else went in before I went to bed. So we're just stuck with those two Town Hall 9 attacks, but hope you guys liked them. They were definitely uh, some interesting stuff. The new P.E.K.K.A.s and the uh, air combos you can bring alongside the P.E.K.K.A. Bowler Healer uh, Kill Squad. So some interesting stuff there. And uh, that being said, I'll try to have something else come out tonight, maybe like a mini tip to make up for just the two attacks that were in this video because it was kind of a shorter one. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless, and I'll see you guys later. Bye, Sectatron out.